Okay, so you've made the conscious decision to ditch the car or suspend the commuter rail pass and pedal your way to and from work. Congratulations, you have joined the League of Bicycle Commuters. And as an indoctrination into that league, let me give you a list of the top 12 things you should have on hand when you're bicycle commuting. First and foremost, you're gonna want a helmet. This is gonna cut down on the possibility of blunt force trauma to your head in the event that you do get into an accident. It's a no brainer, wear a helmet. You're gonna to wanna to protect that investment by purchasing a heavy duty lock, preferably one that goes around the frame and rear tire. And while you're at it, remain hypervigilant and purchase a chain for the front tire. If you're gonna be biking after dusk or before dawn, you're gonna need a set of bike lights. Massachusetts law mandates a white light in the front and a red light in the rear. It's also a good idea to have these on on overcast days or days when it's raining or snowing. Follow the same protocols as if you were driving a car. Keep calm, stay hydrated. No matter the season, you're likely to sweat when you're biking. In order to replenish your fluids, keep a water bottle handy. No doubt about it, you're bound to get a flat on a ride, possibly even two on the same ride. So keep two tubes handy at all times. If you've exhausted your tube supply or are just looking to save rubber, keep a patch kit on hand to seal those small leaks. A pair of tire irons can be instrumental in loosening a tight tire from a rim. They're inexpensive and well worth carrying. You fix that flat, now it's time to fill that tube with air. You have the traditional hand pump or you have the CO2 pump. Personally, I prefer the hand pump. I'd rather not pay for CO2 cartridge replacements. Let's keep air free. Now for the bicyclist Swiss Army knife, the multi-tool. You've got hex wrenches to adjust your seat post or handlebars. You've got the chain tool. You've got a multitude of different tools. This is one-stop shopping at its best. To limit the wear and tear in your chain, you're gonna wanna clean it and lubricate it. I prefer a biodegradable option to stay on that environmentally friendly kick. After all, we are zero carbon emitters. All this talk of bike repair is making my hands feel a bit grimy. That's why it's good to keep a pair of rubber gloves on your bike so that you can make the fix and show up for work with clean hands. Remaining on the clean tip, you're gonna wanna use a pair of fenders to keep the muck on the road off your clothes. Last but certainly not least, pack a first aid kit with a variety of bandages and antiseptic to deal with the cuts and scrapes that come along the road. That's all I've got on my list, but I encourage you to post your list on our blog.